Windows 11 comes with certain system requirements like secure boot that can lead to some complications. One of the common errors that people get when enabling secure boot in the BIOS is the secure boot can be enabled when system in user mode. Due to this, some are unable to install Windows 11 on their system or play games like Valorant and FIFA 23. Luckily, there is a simple and easy fix to this problem. If you're getting this error, you're likely already in the BIOS of your system. You go ahead and double click the secure boot option, click enabled and all you get is this annoying secure boot can be enabled when system in user mode error. But before we get to fixing it, we are trying to hit 10,000 subscribers on YouTube. Please consider subscribing to the channel so we can continue making such content. The steps that we are going to show you work almost the same for both Gigabyte and MSI motherboards. However, if you are facing this issue on any other motherboard, you can try following the same steps or check the motherboard manufacturer's support page for more information. So with secure boot already disabled, go to secure boot mode and change it from standard to custom. Once you do that, you'll find that the options below it are now clickable. If you're on a Gigabyte motherboard, go to Restore Factory Keys. On an MSI board, this option should say Enroll All Factory Default Keys. Double click on it and select the Yes option. After this, if the system asks you to reset, click on No. In my case, that pop up doesn't appear. Now, after restoring factory keys, you should be able to go to Secure Boot and enable it. Once you're done with that, change the Secure Boot mode back to Standard. Then go to the Save and Exit tab at the top and click Save and Exit Setup to apply the changes. Your PC should boot back into Windows and Secure Boot should now be enabled. You can check the status of Secure Boot by going to Search, type System Information and open the top result. Now look for the Secure Boot state and it should say On. And that's it. If you're looking to learn more about Secure Boot, what it is, why is it important and how it can be enabled, you can check out our detailed video about the same. The link for it is in the description. We hope that this video was able to help you fix the problem. If it did, then please hit the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you for watching.